Hello and welcome today on BOI Weekly. The federal government hits the road again, extending the benefits of its social intervention initiative, the Government Enterprise and Empowerment Program, Jeep Trade Money, to Emo and Oyo states. The Vice President, Professor Yemio Shimbadu, interacts with thousands of traders, artisans, as well as market men and women in both states as he launches the interest free microcredit scheme. No fewer than 24,000 traders are expected to benefit from the scheme in Oyo and Imo states. I'm Kayode Alayode. Welcome to the program. Starting your business shouldn't be a scare when you have the right support. Support that helps you grow. Support that helps you expand beyond borders. And this support extends to every single person on the value chain. All the way down to the leaders of the next generation. At Bank of Industry, we believe that supporting one is supporting all. With a system set up to provide financial and advisory support for growing and large businesses. Visit any of our offices, website, or social media pages to get in on how you can benefit from this today. Bank of Industry. Transforming Nigeria's industrial sector. In a bid to ensure that the dividends of democracy trickle down to the very bottom of the pyramid, the federal government, back in 2016, commenced the social intervention program. Rather than just randomly throw cash at the people, the government decided to target micro-enterprises with a non-collateralized scheme called the Government Enterprise and Empowerment Program, JEEP, and asked the Bank of Industry to execute it. The microcredit scheme promises funds of between 10 to 100,000 naira to artisans, petty traders, as well as market men and women all across the country under three divisions, namely the Jeep Market Money, the Jeep Farmer Money, and the Jeep Trader Money. In the last two years, the government has successfully disbursed between 50 and 100,000 Naira loans to almost half a million beneficiaries in all the 36 states of the Federation, including the Federal Capital Territory, in the Jeep Market Money Revolving Loan Scheme. The Jeep Farmer Money, targeted at farmers, is also running smoothly on the side. On August the 7th, 2018, the federal government commenced the third offshoot of the Jeep initiative called Trader Money in a physical activation across five markets here in Lagos. The 10,000 Naira Trader Money loan disbursement also managed by the Bank of Industry as part of the President Mohamed Buhari administration's drive to empower over 2 million petty traders and artisans across the country. Since then, the Jeep Trader Money scheme has been going from state to state, leaving more hopeful and empowered petty traders in its trail. To be sure the federal government takes the program seriously, His Excellency the Vice President has personally launched the initiative in some of the 12 states so far touched by the intervention. These include Abuja, Lagos, Edo, Oshun, Cross River, Oyo, and Imo states. Here's how the market activation went down at the relief market in Oweri, the Imo state capital. The Bank of Industry has hired over 4,000 enumerators enrolling potential beneficiaries into the program. Some of them are here in Imo State, working to ensure a seamless collection of biometric data on the traders. It's a day to be remembered here at the relief market in Oweri. <laughs> The 
Commissioner for Happiness and Purpose Fulfillment in Imo State, Ogechi Ololo, is on ground to ensure that everything goes well. As you can see, this is making people happy. So that's why I'm also standing here on behalf of my governor to ensure that our people indeed were treated well. So we are excited, and you can see the faces of Imo Light, they are very excited. So this also, even though it's not the stand on my ministry, this is also the job of my ministry. So we are excited about it. I feel very good because I've gone around myself to interview people and be sure that they have gotten money. Of course, in a setting like this, there's always one person to tell you, I've not received anything. But I've also seen the team of the vice president going around to ensure that those people who have not received an alert have their own cash today. So I think they are ready and they are prepared to do it. As well as the Imo State government, we are also ready to render our help because this is also something that is coming to Imo State. So we are excited, the governor is excited, and we are happy. So we are encouraging all Imo lights, those of you who have not registered, have not received a lot, to please come to the Ministry of Happiness on Monday and Tuesdays and Wednesday to make sure that we register you so that way we can send your information to them for proper crediting. Soon, the host, Governor of Imo State, Rocha Zokorocha, ushers His Excellency the Vice President, Professor Yemi Oshnibajo, into the market as he freely interacts with the traders. <laughs> the Executive Director, Micro Enterprises at the Bank of Industry, Mrs. Tunya Adeniji, talks about the initiative in Imo State. We are doing the market activation or launch of the trader money loan which is a federal government incentive or intervention to petty traders across Nigeria this is um, one of the is about the eighth market that um, we're going to visit as you can see we already have so many people um, wearing the t-shirts which means that they are beneficiaries already and our agents are in the markets continuing to enumerate people to make sure that we have a good coverage of the market it is, it is a microcredit loan, it's not a grant. We expect that the beneficiaries will pay back over six months. And when they pay back, they are able to get even a higher loan. One of the other things we expect them to do is to open a bank account so that subsequent loans can be dispersed into a bank account. We have um, our agents on ground, but I think what is quite obvious when you go to a market environment like this is that there's a, lot of, there's a lot of activity, there's a lot of buying and selling. People are here for business, people are here to make a living. People are here because they need that income. And so we are very confident that the beneficiaries of these loans will pay them back because they also want to, ask to do more. It's um, an aspirational loan, it's an aspirational facility. And the idea is to help them grow their business. After all is said and done, the day ends with a purpose being achieved, a more hopeful, happy and empowered set of petty traders in Imo State. I'm very happy because some of us here don't have money to stand for their business, but with this money, you can use it to start one or two things. I'm very happy, I'm a, I appreciate I'm using like uh, 40 to 50,000 naira, but if I got this one now, we'll then add it. I'm excited. I really appreciate them for what they are doing. I really appreciate them. Let them carry it on.